Burbank Housing, we consider a community resource. Our role is to respond to the greatest community needs when it comes to housing affordability. Burbank Housing has been known to build uh, housing for the last 40 years. And they're not only building housing uh, for the residents that live there, uh, they're building community. And they do that through providing affordable, accessible housing, providing resident services, and inviting the larger community to be part of that development in that community and make it a successful outcome for everybody. Because the local elected officials and the community groups who we make a point of reaching out to during our process are generally supportive of the projects we do. Burbank has built almost 5,000 homes since we were created in 1980. Of those, about 1,000 of those are home ownership. Then the other thing we do, which is our core business, is multifamily rental housing. We currently own and or manage 4,300 homes in the North Bay, and we have almost 12,000 residents living in our communities. We build communities, and it's illustrated by the fact that we focus on our people, the people that live in our communities, and we have a resident services program, I think second to none. So one of the things I did was create a resident services group. In the way I call it sort of a concierge service, they connect them to those nonprofits that are providing services, whether it's the food bank, Redwood Credit Union that does financial counseling, you name it, uh, Council on Aging, to make sure that those services come to the community. I can think of two direct examples in the North Bay where Larry has demonstrated building community. Uh, the first is in the development of Caritas Village and the Caritas Homes in downtown Santa Rosa in providing housing to members of our homeless community. He brought council members together, community members together to ensure that this development can get off the ground. The other example was the redevelopment at the former Journey's End site that burned in the uh, Tufts fire and he was able to bring in not just partnership and collaboration from the city of Santa Rosa, but the governor's office and the California Department of Housing to ensure that we could rebuild even better. Larry's vision was what brought it to fruition. And everyone that was lived in this mobile home park on this property uh, before the fire were given first choice. People that live here have been given hope They've been respect, given respect and pride. Burbank Housing does provide housing for a broad spectrum of, of needs in the community, ranging from permanent supportive housing, which is formerly homeless housing, up to what we call workforce housing and everything in between. Burbank Housing really got lucky when Larry Florin came around. He had the perfect marriage of private development, nonprofit development, and public policy, which you often don't get with just one person. He can be a little bit irreverent. He's an open book. He's very open to discussions, debate. He empowers people, and I think that's the magic about Larry Florin. He positioned Burbank to step in at a time that was needed most, and the community, I think, is well served because of it. He's a visionary. To me, that's a sign of a strong leader. If you have a vision that you can articulate it and then get other people behind it and to buy in, you got a winner. So in five to ten years, we want to keep building housing. Some of the public resources come and go, and so we want to be able to create a more sustainable pipeline of projects that we can finance, and that'll take creativity in doing that. We also want to be there to respond to what are the most urgent needs. Right now, most urgent need is providing housing for the homeless. Burbank Housing has been a critical partner to the community for the last 40 years, and what Larry's been able to do in ensuring that the organization is strong will ensure that Burbank continues to be a key community partner in developing affordable housing, but also bringing in communities to support that across the board for another 40 years.